Hey guys, I just want to say happy anniversary to the big foods. This is insane, but it's been a whole year since we started the website. A year, a whole freaking year, man. Do how crazy that is. And bro, it's we've it's gone. It's done so much in that year, bro. I never even thought we'd get anywhere near this far. Like it's crazy, bro. Like in one year alone, it's done so much. Like we. Just crazy, bro. We've made merch. We made a game. We've had like, like, like fifty or sixty posts on our forum. We've started a YouTube channel. We've done so many different things, and it's just crazy. Like we've had almost two thousand people visit our website. You know, like just insane that is. Almost two thousand people. That is like unbelievably, an unbelievable number like i just cannot believe that i never thought you'd get anywhere near that much i thought maybe like in a year maybe at most 500 but we had almost two thousand people doing that coming on our website it's crazy and of course i have to say thank you to all the people who helped me like um you guys might have heard the story already but you know the big food started like the slideshow started because um a high schooler he came to my class, like a bunch of high schoolers came to our class, and they had to read, like, these stories they wrote. And the one that was reading to me, um, his story had something to do, like, in the story there was, like, a flying cheese. Which I know sounds kind of weird, but, like, it was there. Something to do with the flying cheese. And um, I put it on a slide, and I said, is this, what it, is this what it's supposed to look like? And he's like, yes. And I started adding a bunch of more um, foods that said, like, the big, and then the name, as you guys know from the slideshow. And then my friend Dex, who was a huge help, he's joined on, like, the 15th slide or something, and, um, he started helping me, and that was, yeah, that was crazy. I mean, yeah, thank you so much, Dex. None of this would have happened at all without you. I mean, Dex, for reminding me about the big food, because I forgot about it for, like, two years, two years straight, I just kind of forgot about it, like, completely dropped my mind from, like, 2019 to 2021, forgot about it. And then Dex reminded me about it last year. And, yeah, unfortunately, he left, but, I mean, sad to see you go, bro, but thank you so much. And, like, two weeks before we founded the website, like, two years before today, the anniversary, um, well, not two years, sorry, uh, uh, like, two weeks before last year today, um, I, we got joined, I got joined by my friends, Sassy Dragon and Cosmos Cat. So they have been a huge help. They boosted numbers so much. We went from like when the, after they joined, we went from like three hundred slides to like seven hundred slides in like two weeks. Like they had so many ideas, and then obviously the website was founded, which was insane. And um, I was on May third. One day later, Fun Food Facts was started by South Sea Dragon, which is really cool. You guys should definitely check that out. That was really cool. Um, it's really cool. It still is, and um. And then two days after that, we found we started the YouTube channel. You know, I'm gonna I'm play a few, I'm gonna play some clips from all of it. And I'm here with my co member of the Big Foods Committee, South Sea Dragon. South Sea Dragon? Hello, everyone. I'm South Sea Dragon, and welcome to our brand new first video. Hope you like it. And with that said, let's dive in. It's this is our final page for the most part until we show you the um the main slide. He does this every week, every Tuesday, he puts in a new fun food fact, and then we have, um, past weeks, he also puts a recipe. And yeah, just really interesting, fun fact about the type, about this week's fun fact. Um, <laughs> one more thing, I would like to thank...
You know what I mean? Like, god damn, we were <laughs> different back then, bro. We all looked so young. At least you can only see me. But I looked young as hell. And, um, Cosmos Cat and Sussy Dragon, their voices were super high. I mean, mine was too, but, like, do you hear Sussy Dragon's voice in that video? Do you see, hear how high it is? It's insane, bro. What, I mean, I mean, that's what happens when you haven't hit puberty yet. But, yeah, that was crazy. Sort of the YouTube channel. Might say for us, at least. And then we were getting all these people going on our website. We had, like, kids like Ben who were putting these riddles. Everybody was having fun. It was great to see it. And then we, you know, f not too long ago, month, like a few months ago, I think actually to be precise, it was in December, we launched merch, which for me was huge. Like you don't know how cool it is to see, to know, and to like when I ordered it and it actually came to my house, like um, I, you don't know how insane it is to see something you made, like a product or a shirt, like actually be shipped. Like you're producing, you're selling this. And to see people buying it from, like, all the, I shipped it to someone across the country. That's insane. I'm shipping things to people that I made from my company across the country. That is insane. That is so freaking awesome, bro. Like, I can't even believe it. And now we've even started launching advertising campaigns, but I won't bore you with that. That's business stuff. But, yeah, I mean... Of course, thank you to all of you guys. Um, we could have obviously never gone anywhere near this without you guys. Thank you for supporting us, adding to the slideshow, giving us ideas, watching our videos. Yeah, thank you so much. You guys are literally the best. You're the best. Like, oh my god. Thank you so much. But, like, I mean, especially, I think the biggest growth that we can see is probably in the YouTube channel, if I'm being 100% honest. Like, if you go back to our first video, videos, there's, like, ba literally basically no editing. And then if you go into, like, more recent videos, there is, like, an insane amount of editing. It takes, like, eight hours for us to edit a video nowadays. Um, but, like, I remember when, I, when we first did a video like this, where it was just kind of, like, it was, like, very spontaneous. Uh, I don't know when we did a video that was super spontaneous. It was the eating contest. Like, that one wasn't really planned. I kind of thought of it the day that we did it. Because all my friends were there and stuff. So I'm like, why don't we do this? Yeah, bro, I'll just play some of that. Oh, it's the big food. No. Yeah, we finally got it. Yes. Oh, Alex, three weeks. But yeah, that was that was very spontaneous of me. I was just like, you know what, why don't we do an eating contest with the big foods? Like, why not, bro? I mean, it got, I mean, at the time, I was very happy with, like, how quick it got views. But it doesn't, like, now looking at it, not really. But I remember that video was really fun to record and make. I mean, eat, who doesn't like eating a bunch of unhealthy food? Like, we do gotta tell you, don't eat chocolate ice cream and Oreos together. It don't taste good. It tastes bad, bro. Do not eat it. It's blah. It does not taste good at all. Like, whatsoever. But, yeah, guys. Um, and, of course, you have to celebrate. So, to celebrate, if you guys might not know, we have a um, summer event coming up where there is a raffle. So, you can buy raffle tickets for $8. Actually, wait. Before I say that, I remember um, our first event. That was really fun. Cause I remember because it was complete shambles when it comes to an organizer standpoint. Nothing went the way we wanted it to. Literally nothing. Like it got to the point where some of the games literally like didn't work. It was like so weird. And like for the prizes too, some of the things we wanted to give away weren't in stock on Amazon when we needed them anymore, which is like uh was really annoying. And then we had to like get replacements like crap and everything. But made it work. And I think everybody had a great time. If anybody's watching this video, you can let me know in the comments below, like, any of you were there, if you guys liked it or not. But, yeah, bro, it was super stressful, too, because we had, like, all these, we had to, um, get a bunch of money, because it cost a lot, so I did a bunch of summer jobs and crap like that. But, yeah, that was fun. 
But yeah, back to like the new summer event that we're doing. It's I mean we already have a ton of stuff planned. Like we have a ton of stuff planned in general for moving forward with the big foods. Like in one year, we got almost two thousand people on our website. Started a YouTube channel. Started selling merch. Like that is crazy to me. And we want to do even more in the coming up years. We want to expand like across the. We want to get even like maybe even close to like four thousand people. Like we want to get maybe. Three or four thousand more people. We want like we want to get a Guinness World Record, as you guys probably have heard of. Um, we've already raised one like almost two thousand dollars from for the Guinness World Record, which is crazy. I didn't know we were able to raise that much money at all. But we're trying to get to get. We want to get a Guinness World Record. We want to expand. We want to make new merch. We want to hire a lot of people to help us with this because we do need your help, guys. It's hard to run a company with three people. I'm just saying. But like, oh my god. But yeah, for the summer event, um, to celebrate this anniversary, one year anniversary, we are going to give away 10 free raffle tickets. They usually cost $8.20 for prizes that can be up to like, I think, 50 bucks. I'm sorry, I don't really know the exact, I'm still in planning phase. But, so, 10 free tickets, you can sign up in the link below in the description and just, just celebrate. Because we gotta celebrate. But yeah. I just want to say happy anniversary to the Big Foods and thank you guys so much for supporting us and helping us grow and everything. But yeah, see you guys later.